this is cabin 11244 and it is a owner's suite on the allure of the seas. So I'll come back through here, but I let's get a look at the restroom in this cabin because it's quite uh, quite a bit nicer than what you're used to. So it's got a jetted tub. It's got a full stand-up shower. It also has it's got a bidet and a, you know your standard cruise ship toilet. But uh, come around here, it's got dual sinks. It's like a it's like a full legitimate bathroom in a house. So you wouldn't feel at all out of place. We step back into the the main part of the room here. You got a little wet bar, well not really a wet bar, you got a dry bar, I guess. You've got a seating for four if you wanted to have dinner. You could you could cruise without ever hanging out with anybody else if you so desired. It's a nice couch and seating area here. So much stuff in here, I'm tripping over it. You got an ottoman, a nice big, I don't know, was it a 42 inch, maybe a 55 inch television? Step over into the bedroom area of this suite. Of course, this is set up with a king size bed. You've also got uh, looks to be like a 32 inch television. And then uh, just a wonderful area to get ready for your day. Well, let's step out here onto the balcony. We're still in port, we're in Galveston. We're gonna step out here if I can make this happen. Out here on this huge balcony, you've got two reclining lounges, and again over on the side here, you've got seating for four, so you can enjoy a, a day in the sea right here. There is the Port of Galveston, such as it is. I think business ship is still important, but that is it. That is the owner suite. Royal Caribbean's allure of the seas.